When you marry, you marry one. And if you had problems before, come back to the Lord and fix it. Don't stay, don't stay in your wrong situation. Fix it. The Lord wants you to fix it. And He is willing to fix it for you when you come from the heart to Him and say, Lord, I have sinned, I've made a mistake, I'm living in a sinful situation now, fix it for me, Lord. He will. You need to be genuine to yourself in order for Christ to be able to commence working in you and changing you for a better person. You need to be genuine and honest to yourself. Don't come with a mask on. Don't act. Don't fake it. Come as you are. Full of sins, come as you are and say, Lord, I'm the worst case you could ever come across. The Lord will say, my blood, a drop of it, can fix any sin, any mistake. Nothing stands in the way of the Messiah. Nothing except you. When you choose for the Lord to fix you, He will. It takes you to make that decision. The Lord is awaiting this very moment. Lord, I'm sorry. I don't want to be that old person anymore. I want to be renewed by you. I want to be a new creation through you and in you, Lord. I don't want to live in sin anymore. I want to be holy. Not for the sake of holiness, but it takes holiness to see you. Therefore, since I'm dying to see you, then make me holy, Lord. Otherwise, I don't want to be holy, but I want to see you, Lord. That's what matters. You see, you need to see Christ in everything. You love him to death. That's why I'm coming. When a girl loves a guy, when a guy loves a girl, they cannot wait to hear each other and to see each other and to embrace each other. They cannot wait for that moment. Why? Because the love is strong. When you truly love the Lord, you cannot wait to go to church. You cannot wait to read the Bible. You cannot wait to pray, to fast, and you cannot wait to share Jesus with everyone that comes your way. It is the love that moves mountains and raises the dead. Love, not sword, not chopping heads. Christianity flourished and increased with no knife, no sword, no nothing. Love. And this love comes from above, not from here. With all love and respect, none of the religions give you that love. None of them. Because they don't have it. It's a man-made. It only takes God to change the heart of a man. It takes God only. No prophet, no holy man, no angel can change a human being except the one who created you. The one who created you, his name is Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Period. 